Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, hello, welcome. I'm makeup by Princess K, sometimes beauty by Princess K, or just plain old Princess K, depending on where you find me out on my social medias. If you're an oldie but a goodie, hey girl, hey. Welcome back. I'm so glad that you decided to stop by and see what I was doing. So today's video is different. Um, I think with the epidemic and the coronavirus going on, it's making you think of different things that you should be doing, you could be doing, you wanna do. And so this is one of the ones that I wanna do. Uh, basically, I came across a couple of new products. One of my uh, good friends, she was telling me about the shampoo that she found from Carol's daughter, and I was like, you know what? I need to change up my shampoo game, so why not do my hair? So yeah, today I'm gonna be testing out a new shampoo, conditioner, and a leave-in, and styling my hair. But yeah, I'm gonna stop rambling, I'm gonna get into this video, and then we'll see how it all turns out. So yeah, let's hop right into it. Okay, so I've used um, Carol's Daughter's products before, but these are new products to me. These are the three new products that I'm going to be using. Okay, so the shampoo that I'm going to be using is this one, and it says New by Carol's Daughter. Wash Day Delight, hair so clean and springingly soft. Love at first wash, water to foam shampoo with alloy. Alloy? Aloe. With aloe. It's water that turns into foam. That's pretty cool. So we're gonna give that a go. The conditioner and the leave-in that I'm using is part of a set from Carol's Daughter. Um, the only thing is they didn't have the shampoo of this one, but I really did want to try this one. So I did not pick up the shampoo that comes in this line. But this is the Goddess Straighten Strength and Length System. It says fortifying conditioner for weak breakage prone hair. No parabens, petroleum, mineral oils, artificial colors. With castor oil and ginger black cumin seed. So this is the conditioner. Pick up the uh, Goddess Strength Divine Strength Leave-In Cream for weak breakage prone hair. Again, no parabens, no petroleum, mineral oil, or um, artificial colors. And it's made again with castor oil, ginger, and black cumin seed. It's part of the exact same line. Okay, so on the back, well, yeah, the back of this bottle. Um, I like this little section. There's a couple of different sections on here, but it says made with love. And I like this, because it says, uh, love is the first ingredient. This deliciously scented recipe is blended with everything your hair will love and nothing it won't so it sounds like it's gonna be great hopefully it is hopefully I love the way that my hair turns out um, so we're just gonna go ahead and test out these bad boys and see what happens okay so if you see brown spots on my shirt it's my makeup I tried to do you know like be professional and be like let's do my makeup and not come with her looking crazy and then washing your hair leaning over the sink it's just Stuff happens, okay? Okay, all right, so we're gonna take off the shirt. And I do this with a shirt because it absorbs more water than a towel and it's less friction on the hair. Oh my goodness, look at that. Do y'all see that? Ooh, it's pretty. Now one thing to keep in mind with my hair, I really, it is very lightweight, like it feels like, really really lightweight 
is that it is damaged. Um, throughout the summertime, I did flat iron my hair a lot, a lot throughout the summertime. So there is going to be some damage. I understand once you do stuff to your hair, you have to take care of it. And I was not taking care of it. So I will say that the shampoo does its claim about making your hair very lightweight because my hair does feel very, very lightweight. And I like that. I like that feeling a lot. Now let's talk about this shampoo. Um, at first, when I first started using it, I was like, wait. <laughs> I think y'all can see my face because I was like, it's just running into the sink. Like this is gonna be a waste. I don't think I mentioned before. So it has this like twist top that's on here that you just basically squeeze the product into your hair, which is Okay, that first wash, I was just like, no, no, too much is going on. I don't, I don't know if I too much like it. And then um, the other thing is, this was only $10.99 when I got it at Target, and this is how much that I've used. So can you see, like, about that much is what I used. Um, again, I'm a two wash girl, so I understand that I'm gonna be using a little bit more than most, but. That's still a lot. Because it is a watery consistency, I think you have to get used to it. Well, it running through the hair like water, and then you have to really get in there and then start to lather it up, which I didn't do in the first wash, so that's possibly the reason why I use so much. So I'm not gonna blame that on the actual shampoo, but on me. Uh, on to the conditioner. This stuff smells so good, like so good. I wish it was a candle, it smells so good. It's really, really thick, so it feels really luxurious to the touch. My hair, like after I put it in, it was very, very, um, what's the word? Soft, like it still feels soft to this this point right here. It almost looks like it's almost dry, it's crazy. But it, feel, it feels really, really soft to the touch. My hands feel really nice. So, so far, so good. I'm really liking this so far. I love that it does come in a squeeze um, type container because it's easier when you're trying to wash your, hand, wash your hands. It's easy when you're trying to um, wash your hair in the shower, over the sink or whatnot. These types of products are really, really easy. You squeeze it, close it, boom, and going on about your business. Love that. So now to move on to the leave-in. And this does come in a pump. I am gonna re-wet my hair just a little bit and there's nothing in here but just water. Cause it's like my hair is drying very fast. It does not have that like, like that squeaky feel that you get with some shampoos. It does not have that, um, my hair doesn't feel that way. It's, it feels very soft and moisturized. It just dried really fast. Um, I did get some shedding, but I'm okay with that because I know my hair. My hair sheds a lot. Like it's, it's gonna continue to shed a lot. Like there's a couple of strands here. But again, that's because I haven't been taking the best care of my hair. So I'm not blaming the products for that. It's, it's me. So I'm gonna open it. That's five pumps. I told y'all I use a lot. I'm just gonna do this section here starting at the Ends. And this feels very, very luxurious as well. Like, it feels so good to the touch. And my fingers are just gliding through my hair. Just gliding through. Oh, this is beautiful. It smells wonderful. I love it. I love the scent of this. And my hair just feels so good. Like, look at that, y'all. Look. Did you see? Like it's just gliding right through. I love that. I love that. I'm gonna add a little bit more. It's a, not a thick, thick consistency. It's like a, a cream leave-in conditioner. So I do like that. I like that a lot. And I'm just trying to coat all the strands of my hair. I was gonna go in and put, I was gonna use the Miss Jessie uh, Multicultural Curls, but I think I'm just gonna put this in by itself and just let it air dry and see what it does. Cause y'all, this feels so good. And look at my curls. Like, do y'all see that? Good. So I'm gonna do the same thing to the other side and possibly a front portion, and then I'll come back and we'll talk some more.
impatient so I went in and I hit it with the blow dryer just a little bit just a little bit it's about 80% yeah because it's still a little damp up in here it's about 80% dry look at this <laughs> look at my curls y'all I feel some type of way it's like, what have I been missing out on? All these wonderful beauty products and me just sticking to the exact same thing that I've been sticking to. Look at my curls. And it's so much body, so much body. It moves, it's still very, very light. Like, I could say, like with this being my first impression of all three of those products, I really, really enjoyed them, I did. Now the shampoo, I'm gonna have to, you know, figure out how to work that out. <laughs> Cause this water that turned into foam and the nozzle, it's, it's a lot. It's a lot going on with that. But I will figure it out because it left my scalp feeling very clean. My hair was not like squeaky to where I was just like, I hate that, I hate that sensation. Can't stand it. So I'm gonna have to work it out with this shampoo. That conditioner, Oh my gosh, it is so luxe. It is so luxurious. It is just, it is beautiful. It, the consistency is very, very thick. It's very, very creamy. When I went in with that conditioner to my hair, my fingers were just gliding through. Like it's just, it was beautiful. Beautiful, love it. It smells divine. I love the way that this stuff smells, like legit. Um, the leave-in uh, uh, conditioner cream or the leave-in cream, that stuff is so good. Like the consistency, it's not as thick as the actual conditioner. That's why I think my hair still feels very light, but it it's still defining of the curls. Like I was gonna go in and put in some of my Miss Jessie's multicultural curls just cause I'm used to doing that, but I didn't. I didn't put it in at all. And look at this, look at this, look at it. <laughs> So like I said, I did experience shedding, but that's my fault. I'm not blaming the products in any way, shape, or form for that because I haven't really been taking care of my hair like I normally do. So mm, that was my fault. Um, I do have a lot of heat damage on this side of my hair. Not so much over here. I don't know. I always say that I have two textures of hair. I got my mom's side and my dad's side or my mom's side and my dad's side. I don't know. My hair is weird. So there is a lot of heat damage on here as you can see like with this piece right here but even still it tried to do the little curl like I'm still here for it. I'm I'm still here for all of these products. I have to say I truly enjoyed them all. I'm so glad that I put this concoction together. I can't stop staring at myself and my curls because they are so gorgeous. Um, yeah, so that's my first impression on these products. If you've used these products before, put it down in the comment section below. Let me know what you thought, what experience you felt with these products because I'm, I'm in love. I'm child in love. <laughs> So I'm gonna stop rambling on and I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up. It would be greatly appreciated by me. It'll help build my channel and just build that community. And I would so appreciate it if you considered subscribing. If you like this video, you know, hit that bell notification after you subscribe. So this way you don't miss an upload from me. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.